Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a bootable ESP drive for Windows 11 with an Android smartphone. With an Android smartphone, you can easily restore the operating system of your computer. I am using Samsung Galaxy A12 smartphone. So, let's begin. What you need to create a bootable drive with your phone. First of all, a ESP drive or memory card of sufficient capacity. I recommend using one with at least 8GB of free space, it will have to be formatted so if there is any important data, save it elsewhere. If you're going to use a USB drive, you will also need an on-the-go, also known as AUG adapter, to connect it to the smartphone. Before you proceed, make sure your phone's battery is fully charged, as creating the bootable drive is quite a long and power-consuming process. Finally, you need an ISO image of the operating system. You can download it from the Microsoft official website. It is necessary to have that image saved in the memory of your phone. Open any browser from your Android device and search for a page where you can download an image of the operating system. I strongly recommend using images from the official website only. Select version, confirm this choice, select language and confirm your choice again. After you select the image bitness, 32-bit, or 64-bit, the download will start. Wait until the entire image file is downloaded. As soon as it's ready, start creating the bootable drive. How to write an ISO image to a USB drive from an Android device. In order to write an ISO image of the operating system to the storage device, you need to download a special app, Ventoe, on your phone. This is a simple and free tool available to anyone on Play Market. It works without the so-called root access rights, and it can handle ISO files of various size. It lets you create a multi-boot USB drive or an external USB drive for both UEFI and Legacy. Alright, so let's start Ventoe, and connect the USB drive to your smartphone. You can do it with the help of an AUG adapter, using the proper type required for the type of interface that your device is equipped with, micro USB to USB or type C to USB. When you connect the USB drive you'll be asked to provide access to the device. Tap OK. After that, set the switch to either MBR or GPT. Then enable Secure Boot to exclude installation of unlicensed Windows images. Now tap Install to add the Ventoe app to your USB drive. It is important to remember that the USB drive will be formatted. When the installation is complete, it is time to record the image, tap the copy button, choose the path to the ISO file, and edit. Wait until the ISO file is copied.
It takes quite a long time, that's all. The bootable drive is ready to use and you can connect it to your computer and boot from this drive. Hopefully, this video was useful. Remember to click the like button and subscribe to our channel.